I just wanted to play the video that you participated in. And when you watch this, try to remember how you felt when you were participating in the making of the video. It's the time in my life to decide what's important to me. Leave it. Sign the poster to support what you think is right. Now that you've watched the video again, what thoughts or feelings come to you about the video? I personally think it really started a movement throughout the entire school. Like, we never thought, like, each individual pers person might have felt these things, but they never put them forward. So I think it really started a conversation throughout the entire district about, you know, these little individual things that everyone stood for. Right. When your friends saw the video, do you remember what their response was? What did they say to you about seeing you in this video? I think they were all really excited because, like, they saw, like, all of their friends, like, even, like, you know, it was on, they had different, not even on, U they had it on YouTube, Facebook, like, some of my family saw it, and I was getting text messages, everybody was like, you know, this is so cool, I can't believe you're, like, working with all these different people, like, this is really inspiring, like, I had my cousins that are in, like, Waranto and, like, different districts contact me saying, you know, I showed this to my class, I showed this to my whatever, and they're all really inspired. I know a couple of their classes are starting, like, oh, maybe we can start something, like, we could start something else. I, I, yeah, I remember, like, my friends were all text me. In the moment when we first, you know, you first see yourself on the screen, it's kind of like you, know, you get a little nervous and it's kind of like, oh, you know, kind of laugh about it. But as time goes on, you look at it and it's just very inspiring and very, it's a very important topic that we covered in the video and it was, it was. Well, that leads into the next question. Do you think the video got people talking about the topics described in the video, the things that we would not stand for? Absolutely. Oh yeah, no doubt. The the response we got from it, just again, like seeing all the people, all the people show up to sign the poster, get shirts, and it was great. It was amazing. Right. And that leads into what were your thoughts when you found out that over a hundred students or people signed that banner stated that they won't stand for things? I definitely had a sense of pride afterwards because it's like, our little class like started this one thing and now it's become like a, a Long Island wide like video that people are looking at and watching. No, yeah. We, we were, I guess you could say we were the test subjects because we were the first video production class and we you know we started off in the small room we had. It was, we had like, yeah. we had very minimal. A section of a class. Yeah, room. we had very <laughs> minimal equipment and the, fa the fact that we were able to start create such a like a, like a, a, a professional looking video and actually get people inspired by it and and are you now more or less passionate about the topic that you presented in the video I think more it's especially because my particular topic is definitely in the news more so it's hard to look away from it and it's definitely made me want to get into some sort of advocacy to be against human trafficking yeah I yeah. think um, with mine, I did sexual harassment, and obviously that's a big issue nowadays, and it's a lot more people are coming, women and men are coming more forward with things that happened years ago, and, you know, nowadays it's like a lot, like people are standing up for themselves a lot more than I think they ever used to, and now even things that I didn't think of before, things that I wouldn't stand for, like I, specific, I picked sexual harassment, but now my mind was opened up to, you know, things like animal cruelty, like all these other things that I didn't really think about earlier on. Mm -hmm. But now I'm kind of thinking about more that all these, I saw all these other students picking these topics. I think it opened up the conversation to not just, you know, the one thing we chose, but to everything everybody else had decided to pick. And that sort of leads into the next question then. Why do you think it was so important to do this video and tell people? It really opened up the conversation, like, between people that usually maybe they wouldn't, you know, maybe in class they're a bit quiet, you know, they hear about this video that was shown, and they're like, oh my god, this is, like, really amazing. Like, now I want to start speaking about it, you know. If you guys could sum up your feelings in one word about your participation in the creation of this video, what would that one word be? Incredible. Amazing, yeah. Powerful. And then, would you do a video similar to this again? And absolutely. why? No absolutely. Doubt. No doubt. Okay, so that's a yes. Right? Absolutely. Okay, absolutely. I'm so excited. And why? Why would you want to get involved in another production like this? You know, just one video. We got so much reaction from it. Now we can use that reaction and create like a group or even 
open up about other things that are going on in the world. Definitely the powerfulness. I mean, it's so inspiring to be part of a movement that's literally bigger than all of us, and it's involved in the district, and people can see it wherever they are. So I think that it's important to keep doing things like this to remind people that we are still passionate about issues that are occurring in the world. Thank you, guys. Of course. Thank you.